and welcome to another video. Today's video I'm doing my TBR. I'm really sorry this is up kind of late in the month but I was waiting for certain books to arrive in the post because obviously I'm reading them this month and I didn't want to show you guys and, and superimpose too many pictures because I wanted the books to be here. So I'm going to straight away show you what I'll be reading this month. Um, about four of these books I have already read so I'm going to try not to go into detail and review them but I will tell you if they're amazing. If I've read them I will tell you what I think of them. Starting off a book that I'm reading this month and have already read is Banished by Nicola Marsh. This is Blurred by LJ Smith, author of Vampire Diaries and Secret Circle. By the way guys, my favourite author ever! And this is all about a girl who moves away from her mum, who is an alcoholic, to live in NYC with her aunt, who is a high priestess. Now when she is there, she meets new people, but it's when she meets this saxophonist guy, um, he is very hot, attractive, they kind of have this romance thing going, and he sends her like clips of him playing, and at the end of one of the clips, um, she sees a dead body, and then it disappears, and weird things start happening like that, um, she is having encounters possibly with the spirit world, and there is lots of Wiccan um, traditions in here and culture, which I love, so it has got witchcraft elements in, and it was just an extremely fast, fast paced mystery thriller with a supernatural twist that I loved. Oh, I've reviewed it. Uh, that's what I'm reading this month. Why do I always review things? Another book I'm reading this month and have already read is One Prince, Two Kingdoms by Joanna Grissom. This is all about a boy who lives in a modern world like us, um, but on his other part of his life he is part of this fantasy world where he has to choose on his birthday between ruling the light of the dark and the, uh, the world of the kingdom of the dark and kingdom of the light. And it's all about him trying to save his family and friends whilst trying to make this decision and whilst trying not to be corrupted by the powers he has. My Read With Ben book pick of the month this month is Anomaly by Tonya Cooper. Now this book book is all about a girl who is able to do things with her mind. She's able to create things, make things disappear, and all overall just control things with her mind. Um, she is thrust into this secret society of people, like a government agency, um, and there's kind of like two sides to this government agency, and she's working with this boy, and she's trying to learn her abilities, and it's just crazy epicness, and I highly recommend it, because I've read it and I loved it. Another book I'm reading this month is Gilded by Christine Farley, which I have also already read so far. This is a book based in South Korea. It is about a modern day girl, just like us, who moves to South Korea after her mum's passing to live with her dad, and there she's thrust into this world of mythology where she is kind of entwined with an ancient princess and a story of gods and these gods are real and what I love about this book is it's like the Percy Jackson series in the way that there's Greek gods in this in like a modern day world but in this one it's Korean gods like how amazing is that how unique is that story like it is amazing I read it but I'm not reviewing it because it is amazing but I, that's what I'm reading this month. So a book which I'm reading right now is Burning Bridges by Chris Cannon. This is the second book in the Going Down in Flames by Chris Cannon which is all about dragons. It's about a girl who finds out on her 16th birthday that she is a crossbreed dragon hybrid. Um, half blue dragon, half red dragon. She gets sent to this school, this elite boarding school to learn how to enhance her powers and her shape-shifting abilities and she's epic and cool and awesome and I, yes, I'm. this book is the carrying on of the series of course but the first one amazing and I will leave the Goodreads links down below for all these books so you can check them out because you might really enjoy them. Another book I'm reading this month is Redemption by R.K. Riles. This is book one in the Redemption series. This is about Nephilim, angels, witches, magic, set in a school I believe. The main character is thrust into this new world basically and it's the start to a quadruple book quadruple series. I can't even speak. And I'm really excited about reading this because I love R.K. Ryle's writing and I can't wait to read this and it's going to be amazing. I'm going to be reading this next week in Scotland. Another book I'm reading this month is... Oh! Book fell. Another book I'm reading this month is The Fairy Guardian by Rachel Morgan. It is about fairies who protect humans from magical beasts. It's about one fairy in particular getting entwined with a boy and things going crazy crazy. She is a fairy guardian. She's training to be so. And I just can't wait to read this. And guys, I love fairies and I'm reading this in Scotland too because magic, Scotland, kind of goes together really well. Another book I'm reading in Scotland this month is Shades of Doom by Laurie, Ke Laurie Langdon and Carrie Corp. This is the book three in the Doom series. I'm reading this alongside with Sasha. I love the Doom series so much. It's about two friends going to a new dimension in um, Scotland called Doom and they are kind of a royalty in here and I love it so much and there's witches in here and magic and I just literally cannot wait to read this. Like I remember the second book left on such a cliffhanger. I was like, ah! need it and I've nearly waited a whole year so I deserve this book. <laughs> I'm going to be reading Rogue, hopefully by Julie Kagawa. Now this is the sequel to Talon. I want to read Rogue because I love Talon so much and I'm kind of really in love with dragons thanks to Going Down in Flames by Chris Cannon. So yes, I'm going to be reading this this month. 
I'm also going to be reading a kind of post-apocalyptic dystopian futuristic world called Exile by James Cormier, book one in the Exus Ever series, and I'm loving this symbol, I want this tattooed on me, and I can't wait just to read this, I'm really, really excited. It's kind of got like tribes, post-apocalyptic, dystopian, but also I think there's elements of possible magic in here, or so what they think is magic. I'm really excited to read this. I think it's definitely going to be something I'm going to love, and it's a big hefty book, and I just can't wait to start. So like I said, I'm going to leave all the good reads links down below for these books. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really enjoyed filming this. I love filming my TBRs. They're so cool um, to film, because I get to show you guys the amazing books I'm reading, and I hope you come and join in with the read of Ben this month. I'm going to leave the good reads links down below, and yes, I hope to see you really soon. Love you lots. Mwah. Goodbye.